So what we're going to do real quick, because you got to make sure that you can pay attention real quick, right? So if you look at this problem, what we're going to do, yes. All right, what we're going to do, guys, we're going to do distributive property. Now, one of the most common mistakes in distributive property is people forget to distribute this negative sign. And the reason why they forget to distribute the negative sign, just hold on a second, is because they always they don't think there's a number in front of our parentheses. Remember, if we can't see a number, we can always write in the number one. So what I can re really change this problem to is like negative one times y minus p. And that helps people now see that, all right, I am actually distributing a number. I'm distributing a negative one. So I really have negative one times y, and then minus one times a negative p. And the other big mistake is a lot of people would say, oh, it's just y is going to be negative. No, this negative 1 goes to the y and it goes to the p. So a negative 1 times y is a negative y, and negative 1 times a negative p is a positive p. So you got to make sure, guys, whenever you see a negative sign outside the parentheses, you're distributing it like it's a negative 1. Okay? <coughs> got it? Turn it off. Sure. Stop the video. Stop the video. Oh, oh, stop it.